I love North Dad. This is where I grew up. This is where I was raised. I lived around here for 29 years and subsistence my whole life. Summertime is stuck in the freezer with salmons and berries. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty nice up here. Oh, we got another one. When we're gonna go out and go gather our fish or berries or something, we take our whole family or half of the family will go out there and help harvest and cut. For our family, our big family that we got together, we need about 150 to 200 salmon to, to go throughout the winter. There's different ways we can make our salmon smoke salmon. We freeze them, you could can them, can dry them. So the reason why we cut them like this is to make a uh, igamak look. Uh, dried, dried salmon, half dried, half cooked. Either that, half dried, half cooked salmon or panaktak. It's a uh, dried fish when you just dry them all the way. They're gonna be hanging for about a week, maybe. Uh, yeah, there's a lot of different ways to get our fish. Well, it's been passed on here and there, and I'm just lucky I, you know, I got interested in this. I'd rather be living this kind of subsistence way of life. I've got all these stuff I can get, the salmon, the trout, the white fish, the caribou, the moose, that could all get that off the land. This is how we, how we grew up around here. Watch other people do it and just catch on. The family value is pretty strong up this way. On birthdays or anniversaries or a special holiday or a special day, you know, we get our family here to come down and eat. I am happy that I was raised up this way and I'll be happy to be passing it on to the younger generation of the kids. And when they get older, they could pass it on to their kids or they could pass it on to the next generation. Mm -hmm.